Yo. You know what time it is, Gemini's. Let's get to it. Hope everybody's feeling great and productive out there. Hope your day is going well. I hope the day before that went well too. You know what I'm saying? I hope the day after that is going to go well. I may cuss, but I don't curse you, heard? Right? Don't let that fly over your head. If you want to get in contact with me because you want, you know, you like how I do what I do over here. You know what I'm saying? You can go to the link in the description box and it'll take you to my website where you can navigate a appointment with me via Google Meet Pulse. Because that's crazy. And if you feel more comfortable being on the telephone, that's quite all right with me i understand you can arrange it that way as well you know what i'm saying but we can chop it up live and i could pick apart your chart bars but i could pick apart your natal chart for you you know what i'm saying you can get a list of questions ready for me beforehand we could deal with the current planetary transits and correlate it with your natal chart or we could do a, a, a tarot reading, you know what i'm saying it's really up to you but those are the options for now anyway i might offer some different ones later but i'm just saying you do have those options right now, you know. If you know somebody else who could benefit from it too, you could pass the world, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so that's my intro. I'm going to cut this deck. And we're going to get to this Gemini energy. Cross watches, you're welcome. You're welcome. You could, you could hang out. I ain't tripping. Bong. Situation at hand. Nine of Wands in reverse. <clears throat> Okay, so Gemini, with Gemini energy, this is, you're on some old, I've been doing it this way, I'm going to continue doing it that way, because consistency is key. That's your attitude, but what you may be overlooking in it, and maybe you're not, like maybe you're not. But do know that this is evident that people don't feel you're going to change. Um, and that's an issue. They feel like that's a problem. Because what I'm getting is it's like one of those um it's like one of those war movies where they want, you know, the army the rest of the army wants the general to change their mind about something. About something that they just stand so stubborn and rigid on. But the general set in his ways. You know what I'm saying? He's been doing it for years. He got all the medals on his jacket. It's like, how the fuck you going to tell him uh, anything? Right? Yeah, that's what I'm getting here. That that stubbornness. Now, look, whether it's a good or a, a bad thing, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, Gemini. But let's look at the situation to see how you feel about it. Get some more information here. Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, you see, now we get more information on it. You're waking up to it. You're starting to see that you're being stuck in your ways is going to be stuck when it comes to some money, too. It's, it's slowing up the money because you don't want to... I'm feeling that... It, it deals with adapting with the times, changing with the times. You don't want to do none of that young boy shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? When you could learn a trick or two. You know what I'm saying? This is what I'm being told to tell to you all watching this right now. Is that when it's time to learn a new trick or three, that you should be looking more at the age and the generational planets and how they apply to the signs that they're in. You should be paying more attention to the age that we're in, the Aquarius age and things of that nature. When you look at it from that perspective, then you don't pin it on the newbies, meaning the people who are newer to planet Earth. You understand what I'm saying? The people that are younger than you, in layman's terms. Because that's where the dichotomy becomes, which is really an illusion, but that's where it comes into play. It's an illusion when you place it on the people and you say, oh, yo, it's generation so-and-so and it's generation so-and-so. No, it's the generational planet. Yeah, it impacts them more than it impacts you, but it's still here to impact and influence. It doesn't mean you can't take from that. I'm not telling you to be 60 in a snapback or a fitted, but if that's your prerogative, so motherfucking be it. You understand what I'm saying? Hmm. 
because if not, you're going to lose out on some money, B. Like, let's just keep it a bean. You're going to lose out on some money unnecessarily because you're thinking about what other, how other people are going to see you. And, yo, in the 80s was the greatest music. And, God damn it, I agree. But listen. You understand what I'm saying? Listen. Pick up a trick or three. This is the factor to consider because I don't really know. You know what I'm saying? I don't know the exact fact, the deets of what to tell you is from an advisory standpoint. But look, unexpected financial windfalls, B. That's jackpot card right there. That's the Ten of Pentacles. That's the Ten of Pentacles. And what I'm getting is too is that you don't necessarily see it right now. This is something that's gonna come out of nowhere. Pause. <laughs> but that's how it's gonna fucking happen, baby. And sometimes this might come from, like the source of the income might come from somewhere real, you wouldn't have suspected it. So if you get like a lawsuit or some shit like that, don't fuck that money up, is what I'm being told. Like do the correct thing with that. And what I'm getting is part of that means putting on some some new people, putting on some youngins too. You know what I'm saying? Um... Because this is going to make you wear your experience and wisdom much, much better when you do that. When you open up the doors for other people and you say, hey, so what's, what's that idea you was talking about at lunch, on lunch break? Run that by me again? Yeah, because I, I do, and not on some phony shit, but really open up your mind and say, you know what, that shit can hit because it hit for so-and-so and it hit for so-and-so. Why you can't use it? Because you was born in 19, whatever the fuck. Like, knock it off. Knock that shit off. Knock it off. That's not a good enough reason. And with that being said, I'm out.